Hey everybody, I don't know if I'm going to have time to do a close-up today, uh, but this is going to go in the micro, so that's worth something. Hi buddy. Uh, we're back from the vet, and he uh, he still had a lot of pooping to do, so they gave him a whole bunch of enema. And then he uh, they thought he was all pooped out there at the vet, but he ended up making a lot of mess on the way home too. So uh, that's why he's kind of wet and angry, um, because he had to take a big bath, and he's still leaky after that. So uh, anyway, um, the short version of what we know is uh, that he was pretty backed up. We're going to give him a new kind of, uh, hi buddy, um, a new kind of laxative that I have to go uh, get a prescription uh, filled for. Um, and the vet also, um, I don't know, there was still something weird about his x-rays. We haven't given him fancy fees since the last time he was there, and his uh, colon was completely empty by the time they did the second x-ray, but even with it completely empty, there was still this strange mineralization, um, sort of like what we thought was bone before. Sorry about the color that keeps switching, by the way. The camera can't decide what color this pot is. Um... Anyway, uh, the vet, um, the x-ray still showed this weird mineralization that was what we thought was, no, there's, uh, no that's not okay, um, what we thought was bone uh, before in the Fancy Feast. He hasn't had Fancy Feast. He's still got that going on in his colon, even when it's empty. Uh, you still see all that there. And right now, the vet just thinks that it's sort of leftovers stuck in there uh, from his food, um, probably not from the Fancy Feast, but just from the food that he's been eating. Uh, so maybe the new food's not good either. But we don't know for sure what's going on. So uh, we're going to feed him only chicken, uh, nothing else, a diet of just chicken for the next week, and then bring him in for a recheck and see what's up, um, which I think he's going to end up enjoying quite a bit and everybody else will be jealous of. So, um, but the bottom line there is that I might probably won't have time to do a close-up today because I have to go uh, get that prescription filled and then I have to go to the grocery store and buy a whole bunch of chicken and, uh, and this little guy can stay here and get himself put back together after his trip. He was purring. I wanted you guys to, whoa, I wanted you guys to hear the purring, but ah, now I'm dropping this everywhere. I wanted you guys to hear the purring, but I don't know if he's going to do it for me now. He was happy though a minute ago. You happy, buddy? I hope you can hear that. Anyway, I'm going to get him some baby food so he has something to eat, some chicken baby food, and then uh, i got to go take care of all that stuff and probably won't get to the close-up today that I wanted to do. So we'll get to it, though, eventually. Yeah, you're a happy boy. You'll be much happier after you get all dried off after your bath, huh? I bet he feels so much better right now.